A befitting and well-equipped office environment is a precursor for optimal discharge of duties. In view of this, the authorities of Kokaguda Local Council commenced the reconstruction of an administrative building for public servants and a legislative chamber for the councillors. Speaking at the foundation laying exercise, the council chairman, Razak Olamilekon, said the project symbolizes progress for the people of Kokaguda, positing that the structures once erected will reinvigorate the entire council workforce to align with the goals of the administration. Today we get going to mark the significant milestone in our journey towards progress and development. The construction of the administrative and legislative building presents to our community to create convenience and effects work to environment for our public servant and the legislator. This building will serve as a hub of innovative thinking, collaboration and dedicated service to our community. It will bring the symbol of our view, dedication to excellence and passion for delivering expectation results. Today, as we are giving a landmark or foundation for our big project, we celebrate the fruit of our collective effort and realization of our vision. The foundation lane was conducted by council executives, political stalwarts and traditional rulers. Kokagoda political actors were impressed by the development, submitting that infrastructure will reinvent the image of the OCDA. The offices are too choked up. The toilets are not enough. With the hygienic process in town, with cholera and everything, we have to be more we have we have to be more concerned about our health. There will be offices that will be more than enough. We are envisaging more federal government offices, like federal government office desks, to come and join us. We are envisaging expanding some of our programs. We are praying that the autonomy works out. If it works out, we are going to open many, many other offices that the state government was helping us to take care of. Today, I'm happy. 21 years later, to be alive, happy to witness the rehabilitation and renovation of this SCDA, Koka Aguda, Local Council Development Area. So I'm happy for the chairman that initiated this with his executive. I'm happy for the party. I'm happy for the apex leader. We, we pray that what we witness today, we witness more of it to bring development and progress to this LCD. We visited most of the local government. We see what they build as their legislative building. And we look at it that it's high time for us to also have our own legislative building. And I thank Almighty God for, give, uh, for giving us a listening head chairman after everything. And you can see now, Today happens to be the breaking ground of our legislative building. So I so much believe because since our inception, we have difficulties in welcoming our visitors and most of our award, um, most of our award members that want to come and visit us here at the council, we don't have where we can stay and use our office. But thank God, it's happening now. Assurances were made that world-class and befitting buildings will be erected with the provision of a timeline that spans for 18 months. Well, you should expect the highest quality that will conform with the rules, with the safety, and the rules that guide the building. And it's expected right, to be completed within the next 18 months. The structures once completed will project the image of the council positively and improve the efficiency of its operations.